for all things Halloween. This is Hauntformer, and welcome back to another frightful R.I.P. review, everyone. And today, I've got something very interesting and definitely quite different than what I usually do here on R.I.P. reviews, because today I don't have a particular prop or product that I'm going to show you. Well, it is a product, but not a material product, because today I'm going to be showing you a software or an app that you can get right now on the iTunes store. This app is the FX app from Atmosphere FX or Atmosphere FX. In case you don't know what Atmosphere Effects is, it is a company that makes various effects for Halloween and Christmas occasions. You probably saw it at 2014 Spirit Halloween when you entered. You saw that screen um, behind Untimely Death with all the different um, various things popping up on the screen, jump scaring you and so have it. Anyways, that company released a line of apps that I'd like to share with you today. Alright everybody, so I'm going to now show you the three apps that you can purchase on the Apple Store or iTunes Store right now. I'm not uh, sure what other stores they are on. I did not find any on the Google Play Store, but if you have any other uh, questions about where these apps may be located, uh, feel free to comment and I will try to respond as soon as possible. Anyways, the three apps are the Portraits app, the Spider app, and the Flames app. Now, they come in free and $4.99 versions. Uh, if I may recommend, the $4.99 versions are a bit better because you can actually display the effects on your device, such as your phone or your iPad while the free versions only allow you to, I believe, on a projector or a TV, and also they have text in front of them as a watermark, so that's not going to be the best effect. So, if you really want a great effect, purchase the $4.99, that actually isn't too bad of a deal, especially because the DVDs are like 50 bucks. so $5 is not really going to put you in the hole for this prop. Anyways, there's a lot of different effects to choose from. I believe there's six in total, two on each app. Um, my favorite of the three is the Unliving Portraits app, just because it seems to fit well on a TV or an iPad, such as the one I'm using. Um, the portraits are pretty creepy. There's a man who kind of screams, and then there's a, a little girl who ages very rapidly, which is my favorite, actually. The other two apps, the Flames and the Spiders, I guess the Spiders, they kind of crawl around on a TV screen or on a wall, while the Flames kind of can um, burn inside of like a dungeon or burn just you know, like on the screen, which is actually a pretty cool feature. Overall, I'm very pleased with these apps. I really enjoy the different effects and characters that um, are available on apps for only $5, while the DVDs can be a bit more pricey. While I do enjoy the DVDs too, these apps are definitely a must-have for any Halloween collector. I think overall I'm going to give these apps a 7.5 out of 10. The reason that they wouldn't get higher is because I'd like to see some more effects on these apps and even if it would cost extra, that would be a great feature. Also, we should get some more apps, such as maybe the ghosts or the skeletons, because I feel like those characters would also be cool on this digital screen, if you will, or this digital medium. I hope you all enjoyed this R.I.P. review. I know a lot of you are. Make sure to check out the other R.I.P. reviews if you haven't. I just reviewed the Chucky interactive dummy from Grandin Road, which was a really fun one, so make sure to check that out. Thank you again so much for watching, and of course, remember that for all things Halloween, this is Hauntformer. <laughs>